Hello, Pisces. Welcome to Visions of Light and Love. This is your reading for the energy in September. This reading is for all of my Pisces out there. Sun, so Moon, Rising, and Venus for the energy in September. If you are returning, you are welcome back. If this is your first time stopping by, welcome to Visions of Light and Love. If the reading does not resonate with your situation, check out your Moon, Venus, and Rising sign videos. Cross watchers are welcome as well. If you like my energy, you like my vibe, you feel like I'm the reader for you, you connect with this reading and you would like to show some support to this channel, hit the subscription link along with the notification bell and the thumbs up image to help this video circulate. If you need a personal private reading, the link to the email address is in the description box. I do have openings. So if you would like a private personal reading, something that is more detailed and you can get the direct answers to your questions, the link to the email address is in the description box. With that being said, we're going to start pulling the energy for your reading spirit. What is the energy for my Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? We have you starting off with the Eight of Pentacles, the Four of Swords, the Eight, eight of Pentacles, Four of Swords, Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know what that was about, but okay. The Queen of Cups, that is your energy. We have the Nine of Wands. The Hierophant, Taurus energy is here. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. The Queen of Swords. We have the Three of Pentacles. The Strength card. Leo's energy is here. And let's get one more. Okay. The Page of Pentacles. The star card at the, clock, the bottom of the deck. Star card at the bottom of the deck. Aquarius energy. Okay, so I am seeing... You are hoping... Someone is hoping for... To work on a situation... Hoping to work on a situation. Someone wants to hope. Someone wants to work on a situation. However, I feel like the situation needs to be healed first. Someone has not lost hope. And working on this situation. Someone still has hope that this situation will work out. However, with this four of swords, I feel like this is just a thought in someone's mind. There's a relationship here where there is a lot of love And something needs to be worked out that's not being work, worked out. And someone is thinking like, okay, I want to work on this situation. I'm not losing hope in the situation. I want to work on it. But I feel like with their four of swords, it's just a thought in someone's mind. Some, it could be because someone's pride or ego was um, wounded. Someone felt as if they were the only one putting work, putting work into this union. And they got tired of being that person. Could have gotten some advice from some family and friends. 
or need to get advice from family and friends pertaining to um, this union. Someone needs to have an honest conversation with someone. That's, that's what I'm seeing. An honest conversation needs to take place about putting in some effort for the success of this relationship. So you or this person may not be talking right now. I did feel some stuck energy. I feel like someone is using all of their strength and courage um, to tame themselves. Because someone definitely wants to put in some effort. Someone definitely wants to reach out and send a message. But they're not. So let's see what else is going on. Yeah, here it is right here. Someone's ready to take a risk or wants to take a risk. I feel like, again, this is a thought. Someone wants to take a risk to reconnect. Wanting to take a risk to reconnect. And it's because someone walked away. Someone walked away from this union. Could have been over money. With this three of pentacles, someone wants to take control of the situation and come in and have some type of reconnection and they want to celebrate. That's that's what's here. This person wants to come back in, reconnect, and celebrate. Because this person is ready to move towards peace and harmony. But things are stuck. This is your energy. You may be the one that is... Um, Pisces, you may be the one that wants to move towards peace and harmony with this person, but you may be overthinking the situation or you're, it's just a thought in your mind. Yeah, here it is right here. Wanting to overcome, thinking about how can we overcome these issues so and have a conversation so that we can get back on good terms and you're ready to take this action or that this is that person. Apply the energy as a fit to your story. Someone wants to start over and have a new passionate beginning. Someone wants to have a new passionate beginning. So we have the night, but they're not take they not this person. Okay, someone wants to take action or is thinking about taking action, but they are not. They're not taking action. They're not able to move forward at this time. Someone is um yeah. Not taking that action at this time. I feel like it's because with the Eight of Swords, some I'm just seeing someone overthinking. Someone is overthinking the situation. And that's what's causing it to be blocked and restricted. Yeah. Someone needs... Oh, the Death card. Scorpio's energy. Someone needs to put an end to... Um, I'm seeing like a certain behavior or some put it into e being egotistical or um uh, some someone needs to put it into their um way of thinking and transform the star card into something more positive to have a don't look at it in a negative way, look at it in a more positive way. That's what I'm seeing. Someone is, you may be dealing with a person that likes to control things. This could be you. This could be them. But someone is, it's like, you two are not seeing eye to eye. One person is like trying to figure out how can I balance this out? How can I give to this situation and balance things out quicker than what's been going on? Sooner than later, basically. 
How can I balance this out sooner than later? Because this is taking too long. And I'm ready for this new beginning to come in. Something with that's more stable. So how can it be balanced out? What's the outcome? What is the outcome for the sign of Pisces? Uh, see, there's a second chance right there. Someone wants a second chance. Scorpio energy. But there's disappointment, regret. Someone feels rejected. I'm hearing that someone is feeling rejected. But they definitely want the King of Cups in the reverse. You two are not seeing eye to eye. I'm feeling like someone is feeling losing hope in this situation. Losing take someone has detached from this situation and walked away. Someone has taken their emotions out of it and walked away. Because the things were stuck and not moving anywhere. And someone, again, is, is egotistical. Someone needs to make a decision to come forward, but there some. I'm just seeing a lot of overthinking. It's like, okay, am I going to be rejected? Will this person, like, allow me back into their life? I'm just seeing someone feeling like they're going to be rejected. I guess I will take my time, too. No one likes to feel rejection, right? <laughs> no matter what side of the fence you're on. So, someone with this golden mirror, yeah. Some, we are dealing with a, um, someone, this person may be a narcissist. And that's what caused the breakup or the separation. Someone needs to stop doing, someone needs to change their behavior and, um, do go through some type of transformation, especially with their death card, in order to stop the patterns that has been causing this this um separation. So in order for this to be repaired, in order for this to be repaired, I feel like with the chaser, someone may want you to come after them. Let's get one more, and then we're gonna close this out. Let's get one more. See what else there is to say. Yeah, this person wants you to come after them. That's what I tell people. The cards tells the story. Only you know your story. It says, I never appreciated you until you were gone. See that? This is you or either this person is saying, I never appreciated you until you were gone. My entire world changed when you came into my life. But now they're saying they don't appreciate you. They didn't appreciate you until you left them behind. So, Pisces, I'm going to leave it at that. Comment below. Let me know if this is your story. If you would like a more detailed reading. Again, the link to the email ad address is in the description box. Um... Don't forget to share, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you are notified when new videos or any giveaways are um, posted or in these videos or readings. Um, hit the thumbs up image to help the video circulate and um, enjoy the rest of your week and I will see you next time. Bye.